These are new pictures out today of Fukushima reactor number three, the most severely damaged unit. An explosion here three days into the crisis left the outer shell a tangled web. Now there are growing concerns. Could the explosion have cracked the reactor vessel itself, allowing radioactive water to leak out? We are sorry, but we can't tell. But uh, it, it, has, uh, it, it is one of possibilities. It's one possibility? One possibility. Does that concern you? Of course. What set off alarm bells? The men behind this tarp. Two workers from the plant now in a secure radiological facility. They were rushed to a hospital yesterday with severe radiation burns on their feet and legs after stepping in water outside Reactor 3. The water had radiation levels 10,000 times higher than normal. Still, officials urge calm. People who are working in the nuclear power plant, they have very, very high level of radiation. But actually, it's a level of public. They're not so high. The, the level does not cause any problem to the people. True or not, the government expanded the evacuation zone from 12 to 19 miles, urging but not ordering people to leave. Many are confused. I don't understand, she says. If all the villagers decide to move out, I will follow them. Others are furious. They evacuated people to shelters. Then they say, move out. I'm so angry, he says. Today, the prime minister called this nuclear crisis grave and serious. We are not in a position where we can be optimistic, he said. We must remain vigilant. Late today, the plant operator, TEPCO, said highly radioactive water is now a problem at a second reactor. If the problem worsens, officials say they will expand the mandatory evacuation zone. Katie? Bill Whitaker, Bill, thanks very much.